Welcome back to the show. Uh, we're going to get back to corruption in a moment, but we need to do uh, we need to do mail, right? Mail. That's because if we don't do mail, then uh, it's undone. Well, then the box fills up and they complain. That, that they will complain. We've gotten complaints about complaints. We said, oh, I sent you a complaint and you did not read my complaint. So I am now complaining that you have not read my complaint. Thank if you. I don't read that one, they will write a letter saying, I sent you a complaint about my complaint and you did not read my complaint about the complaint. Could we get on with this? Every time. Let's go. Give me some mail, Mr. Livingston. It's a rather nice one. Oh, it's good. This because it's got a photo of you. I'm going to hold this what up. Let's put a big one up. It's got him. He says, not now. And Tangela with an axe. And who's, oh, look at this bloke. This is Andrew. Andrew. Hey, Andrew, this is supposed yeah. to be you. This is wonderful. This must be a comic person. It's from Dick. All right. How you doing, Tangela? You all right? All right. Is this a handwritten note? Oh, my goodness. There's American money. Look at this. There's five American dollars. I should say one five dollar bill. That's a bit confusing. Five American dollars, but there's only one actual bill. Look at this money. You know, I like getting letters like this, Dick. It, look at the way he writes his name. This man has to be some he type draws. of graphic artist. All right, let's let's read on. Dear Vincent Livingston and Tangella, this is Dick in Daily City. Don't giggle. It means fellow. Who's who's giggling? Don't did you go giggle? There. I did not. I heard no one giggle, Dick. Uh, look it up. I'm a fan of the show since Bob Wilkins started back in the day. I'm also a fan of Captain Cosmic. Do any of you remember him? Yes, we remember him well. In fact, if you look on our YouTube channel, you could find an episode, was it, uh, with Sally Wilkins. Sally Wilkins. And she brought part of the costume, and we spoke extensively about Captain Cosmic. Uh, do any of you remember him? Yes. Love your version there at the polter pad on to the questions vincent where did you acquire those pants oh these were custom made for me and no and i think they they started as somebody's holy pants and somebody just patched them up and then they said hey this could be a fashion thing right i, I believe that was in hollywood all right here's a question for you livingston if not now when never tangella don't you think you're a bit too soft on Andrew? The I poor man's now going to get an extra lump on his head. Thanks to you, Dick. Also, here is five bucks because I know it gets you all excited. Yes, I am cheap. No, no, no. I, this, this will buy us. Uh, I used to buy a cup of coffee and now we'll buy like the sugar packets that go with the coffee, right? And the spritz of... Uh Caramel. Yes. No. Maybe the spritz of caramel. And look, you put a crow on the back. That's very nice. All right. Thank you, Dick. And I hope everything is nice in Daly City. It's not sure. How often that's do right. people go to that city? Daly City. Daly. He's getting there. I'm training him well. Don't make that face. She doesn't like your humor. Creature features. Nice writing, with two little stars on the back. This is. I'm going to guess from a female person. And, oh, I've been given a typed version of her cursive because they're worried I can't read your mail, which is from Tiffany. I wonder if it's the Tiffany. The Tiffany? The Tiffany. No, remember As the, in breakfast at? No, not the breakfast at Tiffany, because that was not Tiffany. That was just a store named Tiffany. But no, no, Tiffany was a, a famous uh, singer in the 80s. Ah, oh, yes. Tiffany. Uh, I can't remember any of it. I bet Andrew knows some of the songs. All right, Dick Creature Features, I will try to make my cursive legible. No worries, it's been fixed for me. I'm here in Colorado watching John Stanley in the Old Dark House. That was a couple of weeks ago, right? Indeed. Right. I've gotten more selective in my entertainment choices, frequently making Creature Features my first choice on YouTube. The sinister and creepy vibes brighten my day. You're the modern version of the cult classics like the Adams, Munsters, and even Bewitched with a bit more violence. Well, I'm not hitting anyone, are you? Oh, yes. There's that one. The violence aspect. That's who she, that's who she con is considering. 
I consider it a family-friendly show with life lessons and omens warning us of dark underbelly witness throughout human history. I look forward to your next election. Grac graciously, Tiffany. Wonderful. And she put something else in here. What did she put? It is... I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a collection of stickers. They're Halloween stickers. These go to you. She uses these frequently. If you drive Everywhere. through Bodega Bay, you will see... Halloween, pumpkin stickers, bat stickers all over the town. And you can guess who did it. Next up, Mr. Livingston, a box. A box. A wonderful box. That says fragile. It's all from right. uh, New York. All right. Well, don't throw yeah. it. Don't throw it. Oh, you made it look so heavy. He always does this to me. It's a box mirage. He, box he gives mirage. it to me like it's heavy and it weighs nothing. All right. So there's going to be a letter and things to look at. So I will give this to the lady. And I will give you the envelope. The envelope, please, Mr. Livingston. Oh, my goodness. This is in, like, five-point font. And look, he had all this extra room, and he made this tiny, tiny font. He's trying to save ink, I think. All right, this is from Pat Cardero. Pat, would that be a male or a female? Depends. Could be Patrick, could be Patricia. Well, that's exactly why I'm making the query. Well, how, right, do I, how would we'll I know? We, no, 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 but it could be, we'll, we'll see from the verbiage, we, if we could tell. Okay. All right, dear Creature Features crew, I am writing to thank you for your commitment to horror and for bringing back a slice of my childhood. I should preface that I am an artist from upstate New York who draws a comic about my black cat, Coffee, so I am no stranger to terror. Now on to the gifts. I got Tangela a coffee t-shirt a coffee t-shirt because the shirt glows in the dark like a cat's eyes. Oh, look at this. Coffee. I like that. You know, sometimes her eyes look like that. Mm. Uh, so as long as she wears this shirt, she will never be able to sneak up on anyone again. Don't be fooled by that. Mm. She can sneak up to people dressed in white. I must apologize to Mr. Livingston. I just found out he is a dedicated tea drinker. So until I get a cat named Earl Grey, I hope he enjoys coffee. this coffee mug. Oh, thank you. For Vince, I got two coffee posters. One is with her and her favorite toy, and the other is a mock-up of the movie poster Tommy, except it's coffee. Oh, look at this. That's gorgeous. Show me the other. Oh, very nice. That's quite talented. Uh, the show is great, and I want everyone to keep up the good work. Stay well, Pat Cardero. Well, thank you, Pat, and uh, send our regards to coffee. Oh, I, I wonder if we're saying that right. Is it coffee? Café? Café. Café. Coiffage. I don't know. Is that it? Coiffage. Oh, what are these? Those are... Who sent these? They came in... With a coffee cup and things. Never mind. Anyways, that's it for mail. If you'd like to send we us mail. We have one more. Oh, I do? Yes. Well, since when do we do four? Change your pace. All right. Another tiny font. That's all right. I don't care. All right, this is from Mr. John Cubica, Pittsfield, Massachusetts. I like that. Pittsfield. Pittsfield. Oh, my goodness. What in God's name? Look at this. He put a hundred American dollars in here. It's like my lucky day. Now we can buy three cups of coffee in the sugar packets. Right? Plus the caramel. Right. And uh, looks like I could read this text. Greetings from the beautiful Berkshire Hills of Western Mass. Good evening to you and yours. I love the house. Thank you for what you do. You do it well and we enjoy the entertainment. You are one of a kind above all others. Well, that's, that's quite a call. Look, I, I don't know if I could live up to that. I certainly know she cannot. You know, she, she's, she's terrible. He's all right. He makes good faces. The idea of Tangela not speaking was brilliant. No, well, it was her idea. No, she speaks all the time. You just, she doesn't speak to you. That's all. She doesn't speak to the audience. No, turn the cameras off. She won't shut up. Uh, so mysterious. You're also likable and interact naturally with your guests in a polite and professional manner. The guests are great and the movies are a joy to watch. When to 
read negative mailed in letters, it blows my mind that a person would go out of their way to write out and mail a letter to say negative, mean-spirited comments towards any persons who only try to spread good feelings and entertain us, which you do, when all they have to do is not watch. Keep on trucking. Well, we'll certainly keep on trucking with this hundred dollar. Don't let her have. I'm going to take this now. Oh. No, no, no. She, she steals my money, and more. Right? I'm keeping this one. This one's going. All right. Well, that's it for letters. If you'd like to send us a letter of your own, then uh, by email, send it to this address you see over here. Or if you'd like to send an envelope with a hundred dollar American bill or a box full of wonderful. What would you call that? Accessories? Trinkets. 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 Send it to the address you see down here. We'll be uh, right back with Mark Rappaport, but first let's get back to corruption. See you soon. Hello, my name is Michelle. I'm from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I watch you on YouTube. You all are just fabulous. I love you, especially Tangela. I just would love to see more of her and what she does around the mansion. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.